What's up guys and welcome to my video on which Mario sequel is more likely to come out. So today I'm going to be talking about Super Mario Sunshine, Super Mario Galaxy and Super Mario Odyssey. And the only one of those games that already has a sequel is Super Mario Galaxy. And I'm going to be discussing which one is more likely to get another sequel for the Nintendo Switch. Now in my opinion the main competition is between getting a Super Mario Galaxy 3 or a Super Mario Odyssey 2. And the reason I think a Sunshine sequel is the least likely is because there's only so much you can do with like the beach watery theme. And Nintendo did so well making tons of creative levels for Mario sunshine but I think for the next 3D Mario game to be really good it's gonna need a lot of variety which you can't really have using the beach theme again and Super Mario Galaxy has so much opportunity for variety because it's just set in space where you can make any galaxy a thing and they've really shown that with both of the games already like there's so many different levels and cool ideas that I couldn't even think of myself. And the same with Super Mario Odyssey because there's just a ton of different kingdoms and they could come up with so many more unique ideas and yeah they barely scratched the surface with what they could do in Mario Odyssey 1. So that's why I think these two are much more likely to get a sequel from Nintendo. And like the main differences between these two is in Mario Galaxy it's more of a linear game where you follow a set path to get a star at the end of each level but in Super Mario Odyssey it's just massive kingdoms where you explore and get different moons and you can literally find them anywhere. There's like the main moons you get from doing the proper quests they want you to do but then you can just go off and explore and collect tons of others but in Mario Galaxy you almost always have to find the star that they want you to get and every time you collect a star you get sent back to the observatory and then you have to select the level again so you can't like collect multiple stars in one level at once. So there's actually an unsolved mystery about Mario Odyssey where in a screenshot you could see it, the map of the world actually had an island shaped like Delfino Plaza from Mario Sunshine and people thought this was going to be in the game at launch and then when it wasn't they thought it was going to be a DLC kingdom coming out but we never actually got the DLC for the game with new kingdoms and people were really sure that Mario Odyssey was going to be getting DLC with extra kingdoms because there was just so much opportunity to add new stuff to the game and extra content and this hasn't come out and it's been years and they're definitely not going to make DLC for this game anymore and they've been keeping kind of quiet about it and so this could actually hint that they've been working on just making all of the DLC they would have done for that game and putting it into one huge sequel for Mario Odyssey and that wouldn't actually surprise me because Mario Galaxy 1 had a similar start to Mario Odyssey 1 like they were both very successful and so Mario Galaxy 1 on the Wii was succeeding a lot so they made like a Mario Galaxy 2 where it's a very similar premise and there's just a lot of extra levels because they hadn't even finished all of their ideas in the first game so they just had a lot of extra ideas to add to a second one and I feel like that could go the same way with Mario Odyssey 2 because they had a lot of open world levels and there were some smaller ones though which they could have expanded upon and they might be like working on making new one in the future because there's still lots of other types of kingdoms they could do and yeah I'm definitely feeling like if they were going to do a sequel to a Mario game they would probably pick Mario Odyssey 2 for the Nintendo Switch because they already have the engine built for Mario Odyssey on the Nintendo Switch so they wouldn't have to do anything different with that and yeah the game just feels like they could do a lot more with it in a future one and people do have some issues with it having too many moons some of them are repeats of other moons so I think they'd be able to make an even better game with the same idea as Odyssey with the sandbox formula of collecting moons and because they've already got a Mario Galaxy 2 they've done so many ideas with that um, using like the gravity mechanics of each galaxy because that was like a main thing in Mario Galaxy was gravity and how it could go in a circle or switch and like change direction and they've done a lot with that in Mario Galaxy 1 and 2 so they might have run out of ideas for that. There is still a chance they'll do a sequel to Mario Galaxy though um, because they did actually recently port over Super Mario Galaxy 1 to the switch without porting over number 2 and people were quite sad to see that number 2 wasn't there but if they were working on Mario Galaxy 3 then maybe they wanted to not give people too much of the old games before they're about to announce a brand new Mario Galaxy 3 which could make sense and there probably still is a lot of Galaxy ideas they had that they didn't get to do in the sequel on the Wii but I think it's most likely they'll do a Mario Odyssey 2 if they're going to make a sequel of any of the 3D Mario games because it's already on the Switch and it makes sense to do a sequel to a game that only has one other game rather than making a third game in a series because people might be getting tired of that but yeah let me know in the comments what you think and tell me which sequel you would prefer the most out of those three Mario games. I didn't put Mario 64 in here because it's not really like the others, it, it's just a bunch of platforming levels in one game but the others have like an actual theme like they're in space or it's like an open world kingdom or you use the flood pack in Mario Sunshine so I really doubt they'd make a sequel to Mario 64 and it wouldn't be able to be called that so it would never really have a sequel because it's not on the Nintendo 64 which makes sense but anyway yeah let me know in the comments which one you would want the most. I think I would probably want Mario Odyssey 2 even though I love Mario Galaxy 1 and 2, I definitely want more open worlds to explore because that would just be amazing. I remember the first time I played Mario Odyssey 1 and how exciting that was like finding new areas. There's also like little linear areas inside the big open world ones and I really want to see more of that. So yeah, um, that's definitely my top pick if I was going to 
choose one of the three. So I hope you enjoyed my uh, my video of me just rambling on about these games. It was probably quite boring. I just get really excited about a new 3D Mario game. Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. See you guys.